After I posted an Insta story of my meal at Mei Sushi, a friend DM to say we should catch up over Japanese food. And just like that, I finally am getting to check out Suzuki Omakase. You may find Suzuki san familiar, and that's because he was previously the head chef at Sushi Ishi. And here's a little tidbit about Sushi Ishi. Mazaki san was the head chef when I first dined at Sushi Ishi in 2017. He subsequently left to open Sushi Masaki in 2020. And that's when Suzuki san was appointed as head chef. But he also left to open Suzuki Omakase earlier this year in August. I have not been back to Sushi Ishi since, but I heard the current lead is Nakasan. So, yes, Suzuki Omakase is three months old and is located at the new Mondrian Hotel. And oh, before I forget, we ordered the $380 menu. This fish is a katsu no modori katsu, otan bonit, the smoked bonit. On top, the baby spring onion and the onion sauce. And we are off to a very good start. The bonito was beautifully smoked and the onion sauce went really well with it. This is a shira ai, the on top the, the tofu sauce and the walnut. And then the shiitake mushroom, the Hokkaido shako. Shako is a mentis mushroom. I have quite the goldfish memory but I'm very sure I haven't had menti stream recently. Menti stream is not a commonly used ingredient in Singapore, so this was a pure delight. And I thought the pairing tofu cream was ingenious. I absolutely loved it. From my side, and this fish is a isaki. Isaki is a ground fish. It's a kuromutsu. Kuromutsu is a Japanese goldfish kind of the sea perch. Uh, Chutoro from uh, Nagasaki Prefecture. No sin, just pure dashi, pure umami. Inside a small turnip and a kani shinjo. Kani shinjo is a ground meat fish of Japanese side. The yellow wine, the kiku, kiku is a two step mark. It might be too early into the meal to say this, but I am seriously impressed. You can really see Suzuki san's experience in Kapo cuisine shining through. This the soup is a hojicha soup. And because I don't take beef, mine was replaced with nodo guro. This fish is uh, Ishigaki Dai. すごいね。すがだね。すがすしプロフェッサー。はい、ポッキガイ。赤身。そして、そしてこのアワハギ。アワハギだ。レザージャケット。そして、カワハギビバノート。アイチェンジだ。
and a little more about Suzuki-san. As read from their website, he begins studying in Kyoto's Kikunoi Honten at the age of 18. Kikunoi Honten is a three Michelin star restaurant with a current score of 4.05 on table log. And after working at Kikunoi Honten for six years, Suzuki-san went on to work at several couple star restaurants in Kyoto before eventually flying to Singapore. Shima Aji. This fish is a Nishin. This is a herring, Hokkaido herring. And that wraps up our beautiful meal at Suzuki Omakase. I honestly love everything here. I was literally gushing non-stop about the dishes. Like, every single dish was on point. Even my friend said he hasn't seen me this excited in a while. It's brilliant that Suzuki-san doesn't restrict his restaurant to just kapo or sushi. He presents himself as omakase, giving us the best of both worlds with his sushi experience and kapo core values. And his kapo experience really shows through the execution of the non-sushi dishes. And please don't mistaken the dishes as being plain. It's not. Sometimes less is more. The flavors are clean and Every ingredient used in the dishes are intentful. I've definitely found my new favorite restaurant. And I haven't stopped raving about Suzuki Omakase to my friends since my meal here. I highly recommend Suzuki Omakase. Mm -hmm.